you know, I just much prefer QRO operations and stuff like that. But man, I I was able to get my hands on this <laughs> Zigu G90, and man, what what a pleasure this thing is. So here I am on this vertical. Yes, yeah, spray paint on it. Right, everybody hates it, but. It, it works fine. How in the heck can you get 160 to six meters and one antenna with a with a small footprint? I got those 80 meter radio on a 40 meter radio at 45 degrees. Can't see it, blends in with the fence. What a country, right? Otherwise you get these big old, big ass 50 foot verticals and it's just a pain in the ass, but no. Anyway, enough of that. So I'm gonna tune this thing up. Look at this. I mean, this thing will tune a trash can. I'm going to do the antenna analyzer. Look at that. That's right, man. It's an antenna analyzer. Look at them SWRs. That ain't bad at all. Right? Not bad at all. Under two. Oh, wait a minute. This is a trash vertical. Not so fast, folks. Let's go somewhere else. Oh, let's go. Where do you want to go? We'll go to 10 meter or uh, yeah, 10 meters. Let's go here. To, let's get up a little bit there. Getting to where people might be talking, you know. We're almost there. There we go. Probably a better way to turn the knobs, but let's go. There, hear that click. All right, here we go. Two. Hey now, easy killer. <laughs> that emits a signal. Man, it's not liking it. No, sir. We got some problems, Houston, on that. Wow. Come on. I know what happened. Here we go. Try again. That's better. There we go. So at the a little bit higher part of the right 28.3 ish gets a whole lot better that's amazing right okay there you go it's, it's interesting right that's a better look you got to tune and retune. I have an external tuner over there. Um, but look at that. Where, where, where are you going to need it? SWR is right there at, at one, a little bit above one. So, what a country, you know? Okay, here we go. So we've done what? I'm oh, sorry. 12, 10. Okay, you ready? You ready? Huh? 1968. Let's go down a little bit. It doesn't matter. So here we are. 160 meters, right? On this vertical. There's barely 20 feet. Ready? Go. You're kidding me. That was it? Okay, let's just see what it looks like. Ooh, yeah, it's sucking wind. <laughs> Look at those SWRs, man, like four. Yeah, that ain't good. I mean, you're gonna need an external tuner for that, right? Oh, man, come on. I'm gonna eat some crow here on this video. Like, oh, where's your antenna now? Hold on. Shoot. I got an idea. Hold on. Watch this. Okay. Now, now this is just the radio now. Man. There's nothing else in terms of a another tuner in the line. Woo! There we go. There we go. Right there between 18 about night. Yeah. Kind of in that top in that upper part of um 160 meters. Look at that. 
Seeing is believing, folks. There you go. Just don't have another, had another MFJ tuner and it confused it. Right? Let's do that again. Here we are, 160 meters, right? We're going to tune it with the Zego built-in tuner. I mean, it's only 20 watts for God's sakes, right? So it's not like... There's the antenna analyzer. Well, now, this is a good day in court. Starts at three, goes down to two, a little bit below two. Look, that is not bad for 160 meters. Plus, you can touch it up. I have this MFJ, you know, tuner I can always use. But um, how about them apples, huh? All right. Sorry for the crappy film. Let's go to 80 meters. Ready? 80 meters. Tune. Man, I can't believe it only tuned that much. It's kind of scary. But here we go. Wow. Oof. So interestingly, right in the middle of the band where you know you do a lot of talking, it'd be okay. And it starts to pull up. I don't like that. Let's turn it again and see. Much better. Well, I spoke too soon. 80 meters is a little rough, but right, 38 to 39, right? You're going to be okay on your own. Now, you can use an external tuner. All right. All right. It's not bad for government work, but could it be better? Yeah, but for that, for a 20-foot antenna, man, that's not bad at all. Vertical, nonetheless. 40 meters. Okay. Come on, hang in there. Okay, it's not bad. So it starts out a little rough right where you need it, right? Where the where your voice privileges are. It's okay. I mean, it's not good. It's 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 under you know right under two. But again, you have an external tuner. You can touch that up, no problem. So so forty meters, man. That is not bad. All right. Twenty meters. For the love of God, this is my meat and potatoes. I'm gonna hit the tuner again. <laughs> you know. All right, please, Jesus, and thank you, Lord. That's what we're talking about, a near resonant experience. A near resonant experience on the low end of 20. So let's go to the higher end of 20. Yeah, I could have. I'm not smart enough to figure out all this other stuff. Just quick with me. I'm going to tune it again. Let's see what it says. Oh, yeah. Okay, so, but it starts pulling up outside the band privileges, right? So we only need to go to 14,350 and have good SWRs. Man. I love this antenna tu uh, antenna tuner and the analyzer, huh? Is that just a feature or what? I'm telling you, man, it's a nice little, this is a nice little radio, man. I just hate saying it. Okay, 15 meters. What, what do you want to be? That's, that's the top of the, you know, let's, let's go down lower. It's kind of in the middle of shit. Okay. I know, I could have tuned these things in better for, okay, there's a tuner. 15 meters, ladies and gentlemen. 
Boom, look at that. Little bit of spike in the 400s. But a lot of your QSOs are gonna be in that 21.2 to 21.4. And even still, it was less than, less than two at 21.4. Yeah, man. So, certainly 12 meters, 15. Thanks for your patience, everybody. Okay. 17 meters. How about here? That took a while. Let's do it again. See what happens. Wow. That's what I'm talking about. You're going to go from 18, 118 to 168. Thing is clean. Low SWRs all day on 17. 17, 20, 15. Um, 40 was good. 20 was near resonant. Let's go back to 10. Oh, what happened to 10, bro? I mean, John, I was like finicky with 10. Let me, let me do this. You know, 28.3 to 28.5, 28.3 to 28.500, where a lot of people use, right? Upper side band communication. So let's tune it for that. Below two, below two, heads. Mm, interesting, huh? There you go, a little bit of a correction. All right. Much better, folks. See, still under two, under two all day with the built in thing on my Zigu here. Push my arm a little bit. Okay. Oh. Segment. Okay, well, folks, there you have it. I mean, this is just a joy. What have I proven to you? I didn't go through all the bands. Plus, I suck at this videography and stuff, so I suck at that. I know that, okay? But look, man, this radio has great filtering, tuning capability. It's just a solid little radio. Love the antenna analyzer. But y'all know that it has the built-in fan, the built-in, it's not built-in, the strap-on fan. You know what I did? I put this on there to get into here. I'm not going to do the Mars Mod or any of that mess right now anyway. <laughs> anyway, but yet, the Sigma. SE HF360 works. That's that's the it's the end of the story here. It works. It works. And this built-in antenna tuner, albeit for 20 watts, works. It works. And all you need to do, right, is touch it up with an external um, you know, an external tuner. Uh, I have other devices that I've used on my YouTube channel uh, that, that you can see that I've used to just fine-tune random wires and those things. Good Lord. All right, that's it.